Ironman triathlete and dialysis patient Shad Ireland travels across the entire country, usually on his bike, I, I don't know how you do it, to share his unique story and inspire other dialysis patients. And Shad is in Albuquerque and with us today again. So happy to have you back. It's a pleasure to be back in Albuquerque. Well, we appreciated your time last yeah. time and we're glad you're here to tell us about the good work that your foundation is doing to combat kidney disease. And I think that if they missed our segment last time yeah. or if they just don't know, can you just tell people a little bit about kidney disease and sure. explain to them? Kidney disease is, uh, uh, we have a pandemic in this country, uh, especially in New Mexico. Uh, the leading causes and risk factors are obesity, high blood pressure, diabetes. New Mexicans are 296% more likely to develop Gosh. diabetes and ultimately kidney disease. The bad news, the good news is, is those things can be prevented. Mm -hmm. We're here, we've got an event on July, or June 25th, excuse me, at the mm -hmm. Hard Rock. Uh, we're doing a health screening with Loveless Health Plan uh, for Cineus Medical Care. And the goal is really empowerment giving yeah, New Mexicans nice. the tools to take an active role in their health care. Right. Why, why do we have such a high percentage yeah, is here? It, is it diet or? Nutrition, mm. um, sedentary lifestyle. Mm. Um, uh, unfortunately, underserved communities and communities of color are disproportionately affected by this disease. Wow. If you're uh, a Latino, you're four times more likely to develop a renal diagnosis. Wow. Nine times less likely to catch the disease at a point where something can be done. And so our goal is education, prevention, Absolutely. and uh, ultimately driving awareness. We've got a New Mexico initiative okay. that we're launching over the next 24 months. It kicks off on uh, June 25th at the uh, Hard Rock Casino in, in Albuquerque here. That's yes, great. let's talk a little bit about that initiative because yeah, you've sure. got a lot of things going on and I think just yeah. like you said bringing awareness will help the prevention yeah at the end of the day it's about the, the communities mm -hmm. uh, we're a community-based organization uh, we have community partners okay. such as the Hard Rock Casino Great. we have uh, Loveless Health Plan for Cineus Medical Care and others that are coming out to uh, from noon to 4 we're having a health screening okay it's free uh, and then in the evening, starting about 5.30, we have a cocktail reception. Uh, it's called uh, an evening of inspiration. We're working with David C. Chavez. Uh, we've reached out to the governor's office. The Great. state legislature has got involved. They uh, uh, put out a proclamation regarding my foundation and the work that we're doing. Yeah, I, I have that work. proclamation, yeah. actually. Michael, if you want to just kind of say a couple things about the proclamation and some of the things that, that it says about Shad, because I think it's so, it's, you're just such an inspiration, Shad, really. You are. Right, it definitely. Like, here's something it says, uh, Shad Ireland has been on kidney dialysis for 29 years, which is amazing. And when you hear about that, I'm so sorry, but you don't hear about dialysis and triathlons no. don't go together, <laughs> right. you know, and it's, I'm amazed. Yeah. It, it is an amazing thing. I'll Incredible. tell you, I was the first dialysis patient in the world to do Ironman. They said yeah. it couldn't be done. The following year, I did five races. Uh, I can tell you that uh, I just finished the Amgen Tour California. I rode three stages. Next year, I'm going to be riding in the Tour of the Gila here in New Mexico. Oh, uh, so I'll be back. It's, it's, an, it's an ongoing effort to drive inspiration, engagement, tools, and resources. Now, you've Incredible. competed in more than 20 triathlons, yes. and you're making history because you're you're involved in almost you're riding in almost all of the bicycle tours all over the world. Yeah, yeah that's my next project. Oh my god. So what about training? How, how is training different for you? It's got to be difficult. I mean, it is. And, and you know, one of the things I'm doing on uh, June 25th is we're holding a bike ride from the uh, mayor's office in Albuquerque to okay. the Hard Rock. It starts at 8 a.m. Anybody can come out and ride with me if they want to. Um, and and training is critical. The key to being successful in managing kidney disease mm -hmm. is mm -hmm. nutrition and exercise and okay. getting the therapy that I need. There you go. There, there you are. <laughs> Looking good there. Yeah, I, that's when uh, the, the clip you're looking at right now is I rode my bike across the United States. I rode from San Pedro, California, all the way to Washington, D.C. I rode through New Mexico. Um, they said I couldn't do it. And, right. uh, Were you active prior to your kidney disease? Or? No, I weighed 85 pounds. I was that's debilitated. Amazing. Wow. Severe muscle wasting. Um, and people given this diagnosis don't have to end up like that. Mm -hmm. right. you know, the best way I can be an advocate is to keep people healthy, um, oh, yeah. stable. And, and I discovered that through Iron Man. I can tell you, Iron Man saved my life. Oh, wow. Well, what is that? What, what was it that actually inspired you to establish the Shad Ireland Foundation? Great question. Um, you know, when I visit clinics and hospitals, 
in those patients I see myself mm -hmm. and I see how I used to be. Wow. And my goal was to give everybody given a chronic kidney disease diagnosis or an end stage renal disease diagnosis the same opportunities that I've had. I found that through the management of nutrition and exercise, I created stability in my life. We have a new tool wow. launching in July, July 15th called Baseline Your Health. Okay. Our foundation are, is, is dedicated to utilizing technologies. Right. For instance, we have a, a tool that we're launching here in New Mexico called renalresources.org. Yes. Yes. Right. We have yeah, a dedicated Spanish site mm -hmm. uh, for Spanish speaking individuals. That's, so That's great. great that you're doing You're that. reaching out to the community as well. That's all wonderful, yeah. Well, we have to. I think yeah. at the mm -hmm. end of the day, it's about impact. We took the Facebook concept, the WebMD concept, and combined it. There's nothing else out there like renal resources, and it's free. See, and that, right. and that's great. So there's really no excuse for no. somebody to not just participate if they think that they're, you know, that there's no hope, or they get a diagnosis that's fearful to them. Yeah. Look at Chad. I mean, he I know. is, it's, he it's an is the epitome of inspiration. Right. Absolutely. And now, now tell us about the yeah. venue again about sure. Hard Rock. Yes, uh, June 25th, Hard Rock Hotel and Casino for Sinus Medical Care, Loveless Health Plan have all come together. We've partnered. We've got a health screening okay. from noon until 4 p.m. Noon to four. But the dinner, uh, the dinner event is a fundraiser. Okay. I will tell you, 100% of those proceeds are being reinvested in New Mexico. The money raised that. here stays here. That's important to know. That's great. It's so important. Yeah. Because I think people often, when they when they do charitable things, they wonder where their money is going. And you yeah. are you are telling them up front, it is all staying right it's here. being invested in technologies like renal resources. We have an obesity and a diabetes tool that we're rolling out. We're doing future health screening events across the state of New Mexico. And we really need everybody to come out to this event because it's those funds that are going to allow us to be able to do the rest of the things that we want to do for the New Mexico Initiative. Great. That yeah. makes a lot of sense. And I think everybody's going to want to know that information on how you can take on the tour <laughs> by going to takeonthetour.com and you can help with all of the contributions that uh, that we're talking about today for the Shad Ireland Foundation. Certainly a very worthy cause and only yeah. going to make everybody better for it. Thank yep. you. Keep ri keep riding. I will tell you, yeah. tickets are available at the Hard Rock. Oh, they are? At, at the actual Hard Rock? Yes. Okay, Sweet. perfect. Fabulous. Great. And of course, you can continue to check on our website throughout the day for more details. We thank appreciate you, you being yes, here, thank Shad. You so thank pleasure. you so much. And I'm done complaining that I'm tired from <laughs> I working know, right? out. Why don't you come <laughs> ride with me? Oh my God. Okay. I'm scared. I'm scared. I don't think I can keep up, but I'll try. No. Okay. I have to tell you this. It is Internet Safety Month. A lot of people concerned about that. Comcast is actually up next to tell us how to protect ourselves and deal with those hackers. We don't want identity theft while on vacation. Stick around.